How's it going, everyone? It's El Beto back again with a brand new Let's Play. That is Detective Pikachu Returns on the Nintendo Switch. Welcome to episode one. Um, yeah, I did a full the full live stream on my main YouTube channel. It's like well, it would be like four hours. Um, so. On this specific episode, we're going to be starting the game and doing kind of the, the first half of what we did in my live stream. So, like I said, if you want to watch the full live stream, that's fine. If not, go watch these videos. Like I said, um, we're doing um, the full story, and now let's jump on in. Um, yeah, let's jump on into the first um, little area. Um... Name's Pikachu, and I'm what you might call a great detective. Hope you guys having a fantastic day. I just did, like I said, I did a four-hour live stream um, of this. So um, this is going to be episodic um, stuff. So just so you guys know. Um, um, I'll, I'll be like 30 minutes a piece, um, so. <coughs> Somehow he could understand what I was saying. Our goals were one in the same. I'm Detective Hill. I'm gonna get like majority of these done today, so. Uh, <coughs> just so you guys know. Ooh. Tim and I managed to solve the case and save Rhyme City. And yet... Mary was still missing. Even now... The two of us are still searching for him. Yeah, man. Here we go. Are you guys ready for Detective Pikachu... Uh, ...returns? Let's go. Let's go. Um, here we go, Detective Pikachu returns. Let's go! And so, to promote an even stronger bond between the people and Pokemon of Rhyme City, I hereby proclaim this day the start of Pokemon Friendship Week. To commemorate this event, we present this award to Tim Goodman and Pikachu, who say... Harry! Pikachu, great detective known for something... Oh, <coughs> sorry. I guess that's a sign I better wrap this speech up. Eh? <laughs> <coughs> Tim Goodman wearing the iconic red hoodie. You couldn't have picked a worse time to doze off. Sorry, sorry. Now then, due to the R incident of two years ago, some of our citizens began to doubt Rhyme City's motto coexistence with Pokemon. So to those of you who were affected, I offer you my deepest sympathies. Howard Myers, Mayor of Rhyme City. What's that? A Corviknight? Corviknight slices the disguise on mid on metal wings. Corvanite, it just made off with my signature hat. Uh, my dad gave you that hat. Yeah, we gotta get it back. Now he just looks like a normal, normal Pikachu. It's cool. You know how important that ha hat is to me, and Corvanite just flew off with it. What a mess. Let's get, let's get it back. Hmm, what's that? 
Hey, Tim, over here. Look, this must be the notebook the mayor dropped. Oh, there's something inside. It's a family photo? This girl looks familiar. Yo, oh, she's the one who didn't look too happy during the mayor's speech. Pink hair lady. And that's my classmate, Rachel. She knows a lot about Pokemon. Huh? Whoa, whoa, time out. You know her? Why am I just now learning this? Hmm. You should return this notebook to me or Myers. Yeah, but first let's get deal with that carbonate. Man, right, let's go, Pikachu. He just looks like a normal Pikachu. Hmm. Now what do we do? That's uh uh this doesn't look good. What the what did it's what what happened? Looks like it got confused or fainted. I don't know what's going on here. Is that put uh, unconscious? Don't tell me moving this Pokemon could injure it. Hey, you big guy, what, what happened to the Padov? Oh, I'm in a loss. Nothing we tried so far is working. Hey, can you even hear me? You, cut your Pikachu's Pika Pika channel and escape the area. Will Butler! A Dino! Need to track down Carbonite and get this area evacuated. But I can't just leave this bit of here. Hey, what happened? Calm down, Pikachu. To everyone, to everyone else, you're just saying, saying Pika Pika. I'm the only one who understands what you're saying. Oh, all right. Sorry, I got a little worked up seeing Padov in a bad shape. Okay, Tim, is that, it's on you to ask the big guy what, what, what went down. Excuse me, what happened here? Hmm, are you the young, that young detective? Yes, I am Tim Goodman, and this is my partner, Pikachu. Well, Butler. Pokemon Protection for Roo, and this is Aldino is with the police department department's rescue squad. As I'll spare you the details right now, we need to help this Padov. And that one Corbinan whipped up it around and knocked it out. Aldino used it used used moved it to help Padov cover, but still has it walking off. Enough. Chief, no civilians injured to report at this time. Copy that. Great work. Now, I really should get get back to leaving the inv invest evacuation, but I can't just leave it up here unconscious. You ought to clear out the way here, too, young detective. Mr. Butler, let us help you care take care of this put up. Find a way to wake it up. Yeah, let's. Uh, a couple of great detectives handle this. You! Hmm, this is an emergency situation, one that requires my full attention. Maybe I should let you help. Alright, I'll leave. I'll leave waking up this bit up to you. I'm counting you. Count, I'm counting on you, young detective. Yes, sir. Let's go, Pikachu. Okay. Hmm? Hey, what, why don't we talk to the, the other Padov? Sure, let's give it a shot. Talk to Padov. Hang in there, Padov. I'm mean, just saying the random things, okay? Hold on, uh, on a sec, Tim. Before we talk to these guys, there's something I need to tell you. Yeah, what is it? These just don't pop up when it's convenient for us. No, gotta tell you that, right? Right. And it's been a long time since our last case. Well, that's true. So let's hit pause and jog our memories how uh, how we go about investigating a case. I'll do this one by the book, alright? If you say so. Tim, this is our first investigation in a long time. 
Unfortunately, Perdub's injuries have already healed. All we gotta do is wake it up. Some might call coincidence for me. I got an opportunity for a detective's work tutorial. Perfect, right? I suppose. Let's refresh our memory and make sure we can conduct a full in investigation. Okay, got it. First, let's quickly go over how we investigate. I'll talk to the Pokemon and I'll talk to the people. Together, the two of us will work together to gather evidence and take testimonies from other people and Pokemon and piece them all together to solve the case. Yep, that's how we do it. Exactly. Okay, the round of questioning is all yours, Pikachu. Sure thing, here I go. Hey, Pidove, can I talk to you? I'm guessing you're pale with that, with that, with that unconscious Pidove. Mind if I ask you a couple of questions? It says their friend is taking a nap and won't wake up. So I think this unconscious is just sleeping. You really love the smell of wet, huh? What's that going to do with anything? Nice strong aroma makes the sleepy time go away. That's why it's saying what? I think the Padova will be concerned about their unconscious friend instead of chirping about some smell. I'm gathering these certain aromas that Padova aren't really into. Yes, that's all we're going to get. Maybe we should question some other Padova around here. Hmm. Hey Tim, come here for a second. Consulting Pikachu. If you get stuck during your investigation and see the light bulb icon in the lower left corner, which is where I'm at right now, um, on the screen you can press it left button to consult Pikachu and get a hint. Oh. I'm a little curious about what the Pidevart was saying. Yeah, his friend is unconscious, but all it wanted to do, wanted to talk about it was an aroma he likes. Yep, nice strong aroma makes the sleepy times go away. That could, that's all I could get out of it. Aroma sleepy time go away. Wait, what is, what is it talking about using some kind of scent? And what was the scent wake up his what if the scent, that scent could wake up its friend? That's it, Tim. I think you find the strong aroma, the, those productives are chirping, maybe it can't wake up their unconscious friend. That's what I was thinking with the shot at least. But how are we going to find the scent like that? There might be some Pokemon who haven't evacuated yet. Maybe we can ask them. It remains me listen. That reminds me, listen up Tim, having trouble during an investigation, you can count on me at any time. I can give you an advice to discreet so no one else can notice. Of course, you can always jump mull things over on your own, but if you get stuck, it might be a good idea to take a break or retrace your steps, then that's important too. You can use the plus button during the gameplay to open the sub menu. In this menu, you can save the game and change your game settings. You can press the ZR button during the gameplay to reread written conversations. Auto conversation eventually disappears, so be careful not to forget what what was said. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna do game settings. Uh, instant on. Okay. Being a love. I was wanting to talk to the. And, and any idea where we can find nice strong aroma? I don't know. I guess you wouldn't know, huh? I don't like the auto thingy. 
No. Oh, 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 oh. And you are worried about your friend, huh? Yeah. You, help us find a way to wake up that big up. Turning on you, the young detective. Magnemite! Hey, hey, Magnemite! <coughs> a little joke from Magnemite here. My feet just what a bit dumb needs to wake up. Yeah, you can't use you can't use your moves, so you have to ask Magnemite to join to do the jump thing for you. Let's not go there. Uh, you know, I I use my move if I could. Well, I'll tell you what the problem is. We got a pet dog that won't wake up. I was thinking one of your electric tech moves could jump it awake, though probably only as a last resort. Will you be willing to help us out? Thanks. If all else fails, we'll hit you up for electrifying and exist. Okay. Just like that. Swap cars. Okay. Ooh, not to. Hey, is that to? That statue. I can never tell what it's staring at or what it might be thinking. But the sort of Pokemon who probably get all kinds of incredible knowledge. I don't know about that, but let's try asking if it knows anything about to how to wake up to dove. Way ahead of you, hey Zatu. Can you hear me? Hey. He's not saying anything, I wonder what's wrong. Oh, it wants peace and quiet. While the sun bathing, it, it, it's awfully calm given on given all the commotion going on. Maybe we should try asking someone else. Okay, be careful. Ooh, it's singing about how much it loves this aroma. What if? Wait, what if this? What if? Wait, if? But I love this aroma. Me, then maybe. Aroma teas. I think that's how you say the name. Aroma, aroma teas. Aren't you? What are these pedubs surrounding you for? Huh? They're staring, flocking to it. So, it, so as soon as it got here, these pedub have been following around. Uh, aroma teas around. You're asking it to the, the nice aroma. You're asking it to make the, the you know, nice aroma. Hurry up, make the nice aroma. We are really getting on its nerves. Seems like it's Pedev are all drawn to a scent that aroma teas emits. Which means aroma teas might be able to help us wake up the unconscious Pedev. Good thing Pikachu, let's ask it if Aromatisse is willing to help us out. Mm. Hey there, Aromatisse, can you, we could use some help. If it'll help us out if we can get these Pidugs to stop falling in around. Fair enough, let's talk to, to the Pidug. Hope they understand us. Sorry to ask you this, but can you move, you know, somewhere else? Hey now, it's not time, not time to stop and smell the aromas. I'm trying to help your friends here, your friend here. Then so guess what? Pretty soon, aroma teas is going to make a, make a lots of nice aromas right over there. You're on the board with the nice aromas over there, plan. So they'll move great. Okay. Mama T should be willing to help us out right now. Not right. It's heavy to learn as a hand now that we got those put up to move. Okay, let's take our Mama T's back to the square. 
Okay, Robert Tees, here's the big dev. Please help it. Her dove's awake. Wow, Rome Peace scent is nice. But it's kind of like a really strong perfume. I don't know why the dove liked it so much. Glad you're enjoying it. Yep, you're a huge help, Rome Peace. Thanks. Excellent work, young detective. That perk could have right up. Maybe you consider getting help from the other Pokemon in the area. Oh yeah, come to think about it, it's a police. <coughs> oh, oh yeah, come to think of it, it's a police officer was a was calling this big guy chief. Wonder why? Well, you ask him to find out. About you, about you, Mr. Butler. Yes, I am Will Butler, Chief of the PBB. The PPB. We are an organization dedicated to protecting the Pokemon of Rhyme City. The Pokemon Protection Bureau. We're just gonna like the police, but it's focused on Pokemon. Didn't know that we had something like that. The Bureau only recently started its official operations. At the moment, we are bar barring office space at the Rhyme City Police Station and cooperating with the police. Protest the dispatch to provide, to provide security, but well, just look what happened. I can't believe a fiasco this big occurred on my watch. It's honestly an, an embarrassment. What's the Pokemon Protection Bureau? We were formed two years ago as a response to in, in the miss our incident that the case that you two solved. Back then, Pokemon related distributions were, all, were happening all over the city. The humans and Pokemon re residents of Rhyme City were deeply affected by that. Mayor Myers was so shaken by what occurred, he took the upon himself to create the PPP as a countermeasure, wanting to make sure that crimes involving Pokemon, like the art incident, incident, would never happen again. That's why this organization exists. Then, keeping the peace, the police's job, though. In the past two years, Rhyme City has been has seen a concerning rise of number of reports, incidents, and accidents. Police are struggling to handle so many incidents, including those involving Pokemon. But now the Pokemon, but now the police can protect the human population of Rhyme City while the PBB protects the Pokemon. By dividing up the work, we can keep everyone safe. Ah, that's a good. That's why we have PVB formed. Just what I l expect from Rhyme City. Howard really look is looking out for the out for us Pokemon, huh? By the way, young detective, I was watching your investigation earlier. I couldn't help notice. Were you explaining? Were you explaining things to Pikachu? Huh? I don't think Pikachu understands what you're telling him though. Unless you two can. Uh, actually, I'm not actually talking to him. It's more like getting advice. No, that's not it. It's. Oh, I get it. You talk to Pikachu. You talk to Pikachu to organize your thoughts. Interesting way to form your conditions if you ask me. Uh, yeah, that's it. Well, we do understand each other, actually. Dude, that was close. I thought we he had 
on to us. Be careful, usually folks wouldn't wouldn't believe you can talk to one another. Whoa! Ah! Uh, what is happening now? Oh, Corviknights! Come on, let's chase it down. Sir. Oh. It's Corviknight again. Hey, give me back my hat, would you? The chief wanted after Corviknight in his patrol car. I bet Corviknight still has my hat. Let's follow it. Yep. Those are Pokemon Christ. Sounds like they're coming from the direction. <coughs> Corvinate flew me off then. Let's check it out. No, that we can. Interesting. Oh. Whoa! Pikachu, look. Well, how do you like these apples? They are scattered all over the place. What a mess. Best to get the area. It's an apple in. It's dangerous. It's here, Apple Lane. You should find somewhere, somewhere that's safe. That's all. It doesn't seem like it wants to leave. Let's talk to it. How about you, off Apple Lane? Haven't seen any Apple Lane in the city before. Where do you come from? Oh, you you go to sleep in the wooden crate, and when you wake up, you're always somewhere new. So the apple van travels to different locations, and the apple gets carried along. The apple van probably doesn't know about this apple -in. Something, something suddenly shook it awake a moment ago. I bet it was Corvinic singles with these crates getting toppled over. I don't see any apple. The apple vendor. They must have evacuated the area. What happened here? So the wooden crate shook, you got thrown out, and that's when you realize your friends were missing. Get separated, that, let's help find it, it's friends. Been thinking how many friends are here with you. Two, okay, got it. From what Eflin said, I think I get what's going on here. But, but, but as much as I like to get my hair back from Corviknight, we can just abandon a Pokemon in need of our help. Yeah, what kind of detective would we be if we didn't lend a helping hand or two along the way? Wow, a Pokemon re oh, reference. Okay, we should investigate the fallen apples over there. I'll be happy to if it wasn't in, wasn't a tree in the way. Something about these odd to me. Maybe we should investigate that first. Okay, we can't investigate because the tree is in the way. What should we do about it? Well, we can't just cut it down. Whoa! This tree's an executor! Whoa! The Alolan executor! Wait, isn't that an Alolan executor? I never seen one before, so I didn't realize that. I didn't even realize that. What is it doing here in Rhyme City? Why don't we ask it, get some questions in? Where while we're at it, we can't investigate until it moves, anyways. Hey, Executor, over here, look down by your feet. Well, don't all talk at once. What this Executor? I'll tell you which head. Should answer. Sounds good. Oops, forgot to to say what's hit. About you, about you, executor. How oh, you miss you middle list head. Why are you here? 
as he's been traveling around with the Apple vendor and explains it why it's here in Rhyme City. What happened here? Hey. You, redhead, tell me what happened here. Carmen I came flying through, and when you tried to dodge it, it bumped into the fruit stand. I knew it. By the way, have you seen a hat Carmen I took by? Is it happened to so selling to tell you? Oh well. Hey. Uh, let's left head. You got a favor to ask. You got a favor to ask. Sorry, but we want to search through those half holes scattered right behind you. Can you please scoot over a bit? Oh good, it moved for us. Now we can investigate the scene. Mm -hmm. This is where all the apples got scattered around. Let's go investigating begin. Hmm. The two missing apple end. That's right, there's a lot of apples here, so I'm trying not to overlook them, okay? Here's one. Look, I, I, an apple and I found one. Have you been sitting still thinking to be an apple this whole time? That must take a whole lot of patience. How well, patiently saying is still one of your talents. Impressive. Look, Colin, I got you wrapped up in the mess though, didn't it? Friend is waiting for you. The apples are everywhere. I didn't go to any apple land. At this point, these apples are only good for making juice or jam or something. Still like to eat them, bruises and all. Thanks, dude. What are you doing? Oh, this is a tasty apple. Do mm. oh, you want some too, Tim? Don't forget to pay for it. It's an apple crate, no sign of apple in though. Mm. Well, we searched pretty thoroughly. No, didn't still don't see it. my head or the other apple in though. Hmm, what could it be? Whoa! Huh, did you see something move beyond the crate? Wait, no, I didn't notice anything. Try checking. Again, maybe there's some, something that's changed. His crate! His hat! My hat! But when I dropped it, and it, and torn, it was in here earlier. Anyway, I'm glad they have it back. <sighs> this was a real pain. <laughs> Hey, get back here! The heck? Hey, quit playing around. Hey, I'm not playing <sighs> at all! My hat keeps moving on its own! That's ridiculous, Pikachu. <laughs> What's going on here? Oh my gosh! See? Told you so. Hey, Zekidor! Guess I've gotta go get it. I guess so. Climb executor is just like another one that we did well, like like Tim, lift me up. we did with like the pressing A's and stuff. I don't know. Are you alright? Don't hurt yourself. Please, this'll be nothing. <laughs> My gosh. Like like Mario Party. Party! 
That's hilarious. Oh, Pikachu is an Eflin. Whoa! Are you okay? Fine and Danny, nice catch by the way. Well, are you are you are, are you the Apple and on the Apple and okay too? Yep, they all seem happy to be reunited. Good, glad they're all right. So one of them was wearing my hat, huh? Seeing it move it on its own really threw me for a loop. I'm sure Nick Corbin had dropped the hat from the plate and it just happened to fall on top of the Apple and. We had Tim, where's my hat? Don't worry, I got it. At the end of the day, I'm just glad I didn't lose my hat. Really, Pikachu? That was a hassle. There you go. Uh, no, that's more like it. Yeah, you look like yourself again. Thanks, Tim. Harry gave me this hat to commemorate our partnership. The award ceremony will resume shortly. We ask that all participants please mm. return to the venue at this time. Uh, I guess we better hurry back. That darn Corbin Knight. I'll let it off the hook just this once. Great work. Thank you. And you as well, Pikachu. Yep. I can't say it enough. Rhyme City owes you a debt of gratitude for your efforts. We strive for coexistence between people and Pokemon in our fair city. And you two are the ideal detective duo. On behalf of the city, I am pleased to present you with this medal. Thank you, Mayor Myers. I'm honored. Of course you get one too, Pikachu. Yeah, I'm the great detective. Pika Pika to you too, little hero. Both of you, keep up the great work. Way to go, Tim! Congratulations, Ron. Okay. Later that evening at Tim's apartment. Tim, I was so proud of you today. Irene Goodman, uh, Tim's mother. You're amazing, Tim. Sophia Goodman, Tim's little sister. You think so? Everyone knows all about the amazing work you two have done. There was the Eevee abduction case, the fossil stealing spree. And the Rhine Tower standoff case, too. They even made a movie based on the R case. Yeah, I thought that movie was pretty good, but how come Mom and me didn't even show up in it? I have no idea, but movies usually do their own thing, don't they? Yeah, I guess. Like, uh, isn't there a reference to, like, the Detective oh, Pikachu movie? I don't know as well. I, I've been seeing a little bit more references in here, like you know, it's cool. Yeah. And, and, and interesting now. At the moment, though. I see. Whoa, whoa! What's with those? <laughs> he saved your dad from trouble many times. Wow. Okay. Oh, the news is about to start. Maybe there's an update on that Corviknight. Yeah. Thank the team. Me. Hey. Yeah, for our own case notes on the R. On this one. Right. On the meals. Yep. Yep. Mm. 
And I think this should be it. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode of Detective Pikachu Returns. Um, hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, yeah, I'll catch you guys on the next one. Have a great rest of your guys' day. Take care.